Okay, this <clears throat> might be one of the sillier things I've done, but I'm all about demystifying math. And so if you have the 2022 Peanuts calendar, today's um, strip might have left you wondering. So let's talk about how to solve this. So we have a man and a daughter and a son. I'm going to let M stand for how old the man is, D stand for how old the daughter is, and S for how old the son is. Um, the son is three years older than the daughter. So equation one, the son is three years older than the daughter. Okay, equation one. Equation two, in one year, in one year, the man will be six times as old as the daughter is now, okay, in one year, the man's current age, so that man plus one, he will be six times as old as the daughter's current age. And then in 10 years, this is where I think the question is as clear as it could be, but in 10 years, so that's man plus 10, he will be 14 years older than the combined ages of his children. And that's going to be at that time. So in 10 years, in 10 years, the son will be his current age plus 10, and then the daughter will be her age plus 10. <clears throat> okay, so we've got three equations and three unknowns. This is actually all we need to do to solve this. I moved the three equations up here, but I did want to talk about this third equation. We had m plus 10 equals 14 plus s plus 10 plus d plus 10. So the 10 plus 10 plus 14 was 34. So 34 plus s plus d. When I subtract 10 from both sides, I get this equation. m equals s plus d plus 24. So let's see what we can do with these. I think I'm going to start with this third equation. And what I want to do is I want to get it entirely in terms of the man and the daughter. So let's replace s with 3 plus d. We can do this because of equation 1 up here. So I'll have m equals 3 plus d plus d plus 24. This works out to be 2d plus 27 is equal to the man's age. What do I do now? Well now I'm going to take the second equation which I solved for m. I didn't show you that but that's okay. I'm going to substitute that in for this m. So I have 6d minus 1 equals 2d plus 27. When I combine like terms, subtract 2d from both sides, add 1 to both sides, I get that 4d is 28, or d must be equal to 7. Once I know that d is 7, I know that the sun has to be 10, and 7 times 6 is 42, minus 1 is 41, and there you have it.